Hello everyone, this is the first official lecture. I am going to tell you about the British history's first important topic, Anglo Saxons. Guys, Anglo Saxons are typically not important topic. Why? Because they hardly consider this in exam, they hardly questions. So if they questions, they simply talk of uh, the most important which is called Norman Conquest or they talk of the play that age of Joshua in the age of the black death in 1348 friends anglo saxons were the people those who were living in old britain which is also called celtic britain or the great britain these were actually the tribals from different different, different tribes they were robbers they were arab years vikings vikings bkn gs jews juds normans anglos and saxons so these were simply the tribal they would have regular fight in between regular is regular scapula and their history is not important but you simply have to remember that the time reached during this anglo section is 450 to 1340 but if you go in the depth and we go for an accurate study that 450 to 1066 is anglo section because in 1066 normans at attacks england and they co conquered england they you know introduced a new generation a new race which is called norman race and after 1066 to 1340 this time is called anglo normans in anglo saxons they used to speak to a uh, old english by latin language but after when 101 one, after 106 is norman conquest when norman attacks they introduce french language and after 1066 to 1340 french language influence is seen in the literature of norman conquest sorry normans are anglo-saxons the literature was totally medieval they heavily the blind faith believing in the gods existence of gods demons devils fairy stories here we have certain epics, but we don't have the authenticate writers who have written this. The most important famous work we have is Beowulf. The writer is not sure about the writer. We have no authentic information who who is the Beowulf. Beowulf it is not sure already, but Beowulf is the class classical uh, epic of anglo saxon is Beowulf is the warrior who is a mercenary hired by the king to solve the problem and the king hires him to solve his problem because the king and his people were regularly getting traveled by a demon called Grendel G R E N D E L and so Beowulf comes he fights with Grendel and he kills him so anglo saxon through literature gives a message of idealistic approach in every sector of life then another work we have is P E A Pearl. P E A R L Pearl. Pearl is a long poem collection, like 13 to 14 thousand lines, octosyllabic collection. But don't, don't you have to remember it. Then we have another long collection of poem which is called Wait Sit. So it is not equally important. So for net exam, now you simply have to remember that they did only register authenticated book, which is written by Geoffrey of Monmouth. It is Historia Regum Britannia. H I S. Historia Riga Britannia. Historia Riga Britannia is the only surviving Anglo Saxon book which is very important. It, you have to simply rem remember the title. In Anglo Saxon, the whole literature were written in octosyllabic or in the iambic pentameter style, but iambic pentameter not the conventional iambic pentameter. Uh, but it was the old style which is also called decasyllabic couplet so ensure that something very old style and there are no language called in english there are lots of diverse languages by these people when norman came the attack in england and they age studied they uh, it is the famous day which is called 1066 battle of hastings or norman conquest after this they kept on you know influencing the anglo-saxon literature by the in a in a normal way and the whole literature becomes anglo normal and sections when chaucer comes he had a base of latin and french language already which are prevailing in a society and he started developing his own literature own culture the base of very new invented called english so all you have to remember is in anglo section is first of all anglo section timing anglo section timing is 450 to 1066 then anglo normal 1066 to 1340 the most important we have is Beowulf. just read one summary of Beowulf. that i have to leave the story nothing is important you don't have to remember anything but yes they people they ask the question that which language has heavily inspired or influenced our english language so it is latin <laughs> the lang language of anglos anglo saxons and then french the language of anglos and normans so this is just a basic picture on 
angular section because angular section is not important for net so those who are following the first books or market guidebooks of Ariant you don't have to follow them because Ariant has given 30 40 writers of angular section you don't have to read anything these angular sections people they are very creative they are very using materials to make the buildings they they discharge dressing styles to totally totally different and these people are the first people to write anglo section culture was far better than anglo normans still you don't have to go in the depth because it is not important for net only remember the 1066 battle which is called battle of hastings or norman conquest thank you very much god bless